Welcome to, to this video which takes a look at how to find out the source connections inbound and outbound from a network. My name is Darren Delaney, I'm Head of Technical Services here at NetHort. Before you start, you need to have your traffic analysis system positioned in the right location. And the ID location is right here at a network core, which is in front of firewalls in and out of this network. So I would connect, in my case, my LAN Guardian to the core switches, I'd set up span or port mirroring, and I'd make sure that I'm monitoring the firewall connections, the internal interfaces, so that we can see traffic coming in from the network and also traffic going out from the network. I am now logged on to my LAN Guardian. So to start, you click on reports. In this first section IP, click on the more link. Here you've got your inbound connections report and outbound connections report. Alternatively, you can also go to the report finder and type in inbound. You list it there or type in outbound and it'll find the report for you. Then just select the report. First up you can change the time range. So I'm looking at 24 hours here. Select one from the drop down or pick, click on the clock. So you can select maybe you want to take a look at yesterday or maybe even a couple of weeks ago. Just select whatever time range you want. The report is already set up with a filter which focuses on the private address ranges just click on view. So what do we know about this network? Well we can see what ports are open inbound into the network. We've got port 1433, SQL Server and 445. We can click on the total to show where this traffic is coming from. So the source of this which is external. External IP there. Click on the total again to find out where it's connecting to. So it looks like a local server and there's some data being sent received. I could drill down further and find out the exact date and time of these connections. If I want to look at outbound, let's use the report finder here. Can we just run it? And we can see then what ports are open outbound. A lot more ports open. So these are clients on my network connecting to internet services. A lot of traffic port 80 and other ports. And again you have the option to drill down to find out the source of these connections which will be inside my network and drill down again to see what they're connecting to. So these are all local on my network and then it's connecting to external IP address using a BitTorrent port and there's some data being sent received. If you click on dashboards then internet activity you will also see those reports listed on your internet monitoring dashboard. So it's also, if you want a quick access to those reports, just go straight into it. On the right hand side, you should see them there, inbound connections and outbound connections. If you don't already have a LAN Guardian on your network, you can download a free trial from www.network.com. You can follow the on-screen instructions, or we also have an install video. Set up as port mirroring or spam port, the inside of your firewall and then you have traffic monitoring in place. If you have LandGuardian already installed and maybe have some questions, please email us at support at and we also have a chat facility on our website.